How many books are there in your bag? Can you count them? There may be five, seven, or perhaps as many as twelve books. It means that the set of books in your bag has a limited number of elements. We can observe that many things around us exist in the form of sets. For example, in your class, there are sets of tables, sets of chairs, sets of books, etc. The number of elements in these sets can all be easily counted. However, do all sets have elements that can be counted? Consider these two sets. Can you count the number of elements in them? In the set of fruits, there are five elements. Such sets, like the set of books in the bag, contain elements that are countable. They are called finite sets. Can you count the number of stars in the other set? We cannot count the number of stars. Such sets, whose elements are uncountable, are called infinite sets. Let's take a look at other examples. We have set A and set B. Set A contains vowels of the English alphabet. Set B contains the numbers 1, 2, 3 to 8. On counting, we see that set A contains 5 elements and set B contains 8 elements. Therefore, both are finite sets because the number of elements are countable. Here, we have a set of natural numbers. Recall that the set of natural numbers contain the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. In tabular form, we write this set as Observe that the number of elements in this set cannot be counted. Here, the dotted lines show that the set has infinite elements. Therefore, this set is an infinite set. Now let's test ourselves. Consider these two sets. For each set, determine if it is finite or infinite. Take a few moments to think and discuss. Let us review. Can we count all the people in Pakistan? Definitely, we can, but it is not an easy task. In fact, our government conducted the census in 2017 in all parts of Pakistan. So this is a finite set. In the set of even numbers, the elements start from 2, 4, 6 and go on indefinitely. In other words, the number of elements is not finite. Therefore, this is an infinite set. In this video, we learned that sets are either finite or infinite. Finite sets are those whose elements are countable and infinite sets are those whose elements are uncountable.